The conclusion above drawn and the, the conclusion drawn above depends on which of the following assumptions. What is the conclusion? So we have two percent of uh, drivers with sports cars, twenty-five percent of those ticketed for drunk driving. Um, had sports cars. And then the conclusion is that sports cars, sports car drivers on La La Land highways are more likely to drive drunk than our drivers of other kinds of vehicles. So uh, when, when you're looking for assumptions, one of the things you can do is look for things in the conclusion, which starts with clearly here, things that appear in the conclusion that weren't part of the evidence. In this particular case, we have some terminology that makes a surprise appearance. We go from um, a, larger percentage, a larger percentage of sports car drivers um, being ticketed for drunk driving to saying that they are more likely to drive drunk than our other drivers. They, they could have just been unlikely in the past, or unlikely, unlucky in the past 90 days. So uh, we, we go from the, the raw evidence, which are these percentages, to saying that those people are more likely to drive drunk. And that's the underlying assumption that if you're ticketed, you're like that makes you a per, that makes you a person more likely to drive drunk, when in fact it could be the only time you've ever done it or ever will. Um, so let's find that in the answer choices. A drivers on La La Land highways drive drunk more often than do drivers on highways not covered in the report. We're not comparing different highways. That's not an assumption in there. B many of the vehicles ticketed for drunk driving were ticketed more than once during the time period covered by the report. The vehicles are kind of independent. We're talking about the drivers being more likely to drive drunk. C. Drivers who are ticketed for drunk driving are more likely to drive drunk regularly than our drivers who, than, than our drivers who are not ticketed. So this is the one that draws the connection between being ticketed and being likely to drive drunk. That is the underlying assumption in the argument. Choice C.